What's up guys, Joshua 6 here, just showing the Viper 12 and a possible fix for last round hold open problems. Uh, I've seen a lot of people post uh, the last round won't hold open and they're saying it's possible short stroking. I don't think that's a problem. Uh, when I first got the gun, I noticed the bolt catch was really gritty. And when I would put an empty mag in manually here in the mag well, uh, the bolt catch wasn't going all the way up, so something stopping it. I looked in further, and I saw this uh, all this wear right here. It was basically the hammer spring wearing on this uh, bolt catch link, I guess you could call it. So that's where the grit was coming up from. And one simple fix, I guess, could be you could grease it up, maybe polish it. I was thinking about dremeling, uh, the, basically all this wear off, and it, that might just move the wear marks back more, where the hammer spring here in the back would just be contacting there, man, just defeat the purpose. So the main thing you have to do is get the hammer spring out of the way, and I found that uh, zip tying it worked. If I move the bolt catch up and down, see it moves freely. Uh, if you try this on a uh, standard Viper 12, you know it'll feel, great. it'll feel gritty, but this is going up and down freely. So I think that may be a possible fix for uh, mags that have weaker springs, or if you're going to get sturdy like, uh, like SGM mags, I know they have weaker springs. And just a little side note, Let's see if I let go of the trigger, it's contacting on the bottom of that zip tie, you can see right there. So it takes a little creep out. That's kind of cool. Uh, the trigger feels nicer, but uh, I haven't run into problems yet. Uh, so this is Joshua 6, uh, Vepper 12, bull catch fix. Contact me if you have any other ideas of how to make this spring stay out of the way. Uh, just to share them. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.